Fashion Cafe was a restaurant based in New York City out, and it featured celebrity models. The idea was concocted by Francesco and Tommaso Beauty, who were both entrepreneurial brothers and also co-owners of Fashion Cafe. Their idea was basically to have uh, basically a restaurant which was themed around like catwalk cafes. They even paid supermodels such as Naomi Campbell, Elle McPherson, I hope I said that right, Claudia Schiffer and Christy Turlington in order to try and promote the cafe 100% in order to get the mainstream media involved. The first restaurant of the chain was opened in Rockefeller Center in New York City in 1995 to massive evasion, even celebrity guests turning up. The restaurant had a kind of a strange location, as across the street there was a Planet Hollywood that was actually in their main competition. We'll get to them another day. On May 6, 1996, the construction began on the London branch of the chain, which uh, had again massive ovation, huge crowds, and even radio DJ Chris Evans even turning up for the, for the party. Though unfortunately due to financial issues, and also internal struggles within the restaurant, the restaurant went bust in 1999, literally eight months after it opened. New York and London were not the only two venues which the restaurant were trying to endear in. They also tried for Barcelona, Milan, and even Paris at one point. But due to internal struggles within trying to also get licenses for building, and also the cost of building itself, they were not going to get their money back. In fact, Barcelona, the footage you're seeing right now, is the Barcelona opening, and this is when they broke ground. They would abandon the project uh, literally 10 months later. Despite all the fanfare, despite everything that happened though, they were giving out free merch to the crowd, which probably didn't help their money troubles either. By the way, those lovely leather jackets that the staff are actually wearing, I managed to find one of those on eBay the other week for literally going for 70 quid. I was tempted to bid on it, but realistically I didn't think it was a good investment. Speaking of bad finance, stuff wasn't going very well for the no, the London branch was doing absolutely terrible, but also the New York branch was also having issues as well. As Naomi Campbell and McPherson had basically accused Tommaso Beauty, one of the main finances of the, of the chain, they accused him of stealing 10,000 US dollars a day from company's money to cover his debt for his personal lavish playboy lifestyle. It also didn't help that Claudia Schiffer had also, had also pulled out of the business venture, stating that her and Naomi Campbell had pulled up an old feud. So they've already lost a business partner already. Campbell, McPherson and uh, Turlington would basically face the uh, restaurant until its closure in 1998, basically ending the brand. This leaves us with the question, what happened next? All the models involved all end up going back to the day job as well being models. And then the two people who are in charge of it, Francesco Beauty and Tommaso Beauty, both found themselves in really, really deep trouble. As the US federal government had, had filed 51 different charges against them. These filed charges that they were accused of are included conspiracy, fraud, money laundering, wire fraud, and also tax evasion. So basically, the $10,000 a day that they stole from the company money, actually, that actually could have been true. Unfortunately though, I cannot find anything on the internet saying that they have been, that they have actually been found guilty or not of this, but if they were found guilty of this, they would have been, they would have been either heavily fined, either told to pay back all of the money, or they would have faced up to 27 years in prison each. Fashion Cafe was also featured in the book Brand Failures by Matt Haig, and in the book there is actually a direct quote that actually says, The connection between models and food was not an obvious one, and fashion was not a theme that made people feel hungry. Couldn't agree with you more, Matt. I'd like to thank you guys for tuning in to the end of this video, and um, please feel free to like and subscribe, and I should be back with more videos in the near future. Again, I'd like to thank you guys for tuning in, and have a nice day.